Our first or next award goes to Duco, which I think is right here in front of the presenter table. Uh, this Waukesha-based final stage manufacturer of equipment for the utility and related industries has demonstrated strong leadership and commitment to its employees, customers, and community for more than 50 years. If you've seen a Wee, Wee Energy's utility truck, chances are you've seen the work of Duco. As the largest final stage manufacturer of Terex Utilities bucket trucks and Digger Derricks, there's a tongue twister for you, <laughs> in the nation, Duco products reach utility companies in other industries across a 15 state region. Accepting the award today is Duco President Judy Taylor. Uh, Judy recently was featured in the last word segment of our magazine in which she wrote to our readers about the concept of servant leadership. It's a message I think our readers can't hear enough of. Um, in talking to Judy about it, she points out that a company is only as strong as its people and how they serve their customers. Uh, no matter what business you're in, your people are on the front lines of it all. Uh, and, and your people will determine your company's fate. So Judy, I wonder if you could expand on that a little bit about the concept of servant leadership and how important it is to have the right people doing the right things at the right time. Absolutely. Well, first of all, I'd like to say thank you. It's been an honor and privilege to be here among all of these wonderful other companies. As a part of servant leadership, it's all about the people. So today I have with me our people who make it happen day in and day out. So I want to thank them and have them stand to be recognized and acknowledged for all their work. Duco team. And as you can see in the picture, we wanted a picture of our entire team as well because it is what they do every day that makes us successful. In this team of 350 uh, employees that we have throughout the country, truly have a burning desire to take care of our customers. They try and do what's right. Uh, they try to provide, provide solutions every day to customer needs, to be innovative and creative with different ways of doing things so that we can be better than we were yesterday. And it's about our leadership team, which many of them are here today, who believe in our team. They want to help them be better they want to help develop them as team members because if they are the best that they can be, then we are going to be the best that we can be for our customers. Robert Greenleaf was the author and founder of Servant Leadership Concepts. And what he observed over time was that uh, there are leaders who are in it for themselves and then leaders who are in it for others. And through his studies and analysis, um, his conclusion was that those leaders who are in it for others and who focus on others are three times more successful. And so it's, it's apparent that um, when you're doing it for the right reasons that you are going to be successful. Because when you focus on the people and you look at enhancing their lives and their education, when you teach them to think, to challenge, to provide solutions to the customer, then your business will be more successful. I think so often that in any given day, at any point in time, if you can think of in your own organization, how many of your team members have touched customers today in one way or another? Whether through an email, through a face-to-face you know, -face meeting, through a text message, which I got from a customer this morning. Some way that you know, your team members touch customers. It's probably hundreds of them today. I know at Duco it's been probably hundreds. So when we think of the philosophy of servant leadership, it's because we want to focus on the fact that those team members are on the front line. They are the ones that are serving our customers day in and day out. They're interacting with them. They need to be well equipped to be able to handle the situations that come up and to be able to provide the best solutions possible so that they feel comfortable and that the customers at the end of the day are making the best choices and have the best options available to them. So in the long run, the investment in our team members is what has made us so successful. And, um, and that servant leadership philosophy is embraced really throughout our organization and will be for years to come. Thank, Thank you, Judy. You.